Welcome to week three, data wrangling level two. Here's a quick recap of what we've accomplished so far. In week one, we kickstarted your data science journey by doing a sales analysis, exposing you to how key tidyverse functions are integrated into our data science tool chain. In week two, we began our transition into data import and data wrangling. We spent a lot of time learning two key packages for data cleaning and manipulation, dplyr and tidyer. Why? because data wrangling, cleaning, and manipulation are the most important foundational skills for data scientists. Now we transition into the second level of data wrangling. This week we focus on three key packages, Liberdate for time series, Stringer for text, and Forecast for categorical data. We begin with Liberdate for time series analysis. We start with an overview of the date and date time data types, along with Liberdate functions that make it super simple to work with time series data. We then quickly switch into time series analysis where we cover the most common business operations, including time-based aggregations, working with lags, cumulative calculations, rolling calculations, and more. Next, we switch to Stringer for text analysis. We learn the fundamentals of the Stringer package, including working with the most common cheat sheet functions. We then switch gears, performing a live recorded feature engineering case study that you won't want to miss. It's incredibly valuable. We close the week with forecasts for working with categorical data. In addition to learning the fundamentals, we go through several motivating examples of working with ggplot2 visualizations. This is the perfect end to week three because categorical data relates very closely to data visualization, our week four topic. All right, let's dive in. 